Deputy Smith, would you like to move? Um, can I just go through? I went. I put a question to the minister, and uh, it was to ask the minister his view on the um, leaked Grant Thornton report, which report of cuts to bus air and express routes, which would have a detrimental effect on counties Cavan and Monaghan, and will he make a statement on saying? And just to quote what the minister came back with, he said, separately to my meeting with the company chair, I also met with the NTA, who outlined to me their powers and responsibility in relation to the provision of public transport services. I was assured by the NTA that it will work with local communities to maintain an appropriate level of public transport connectivity in the event of any reconfiguration of existing services. Mm -hmm. So, can you just uh, outline for us what you, what your vision for an appropriate service to areas, borderland, county, uh, like Cavan, Monaghan and rural parts, what your uh, vision for appropriate service is? Well, that depends on the location. So, you know, I can't give you a blanket kind of statement related to every town land in the, in the state. What we would do is we would look, uh, it depends on what service has changed, if there's any changes to the expressway service. We would look at the towns that have been served by that uh, service that may be withdrawn. Um, and we would uh, work with local communities to see what is the demand for services in those areas. Uh, and provide an appropriate service, whether it's either by um, by looking at the existing, uh, remaining commercial services, by seeing whether we can extend or change the current uh, contracted services that we have with Bus Erin, and it changes to the local link services um, or new local link services if, uh, if if required. And that's something that we um, we did in, in 2015, as I outlined in my statement, um, where Route 5. Um, expressway services was withdrawn. Um, we had an, a number of different things that we did. Um, there were changes to some of the uh, Route 4 uh, uh, services, um, expressway services. We extended some of the uh, PSO um, services contracted with Bus Aaron, and then we provided new local link services that fed into those key uh, Bus Aaron services that provided the connectivity. And we believe that in some places, some towns actually got a better service, um, more service um, in that uh, per day, better connectivity, um, because we were able to design the service around the local needs. Okay, and I suppose just to take it a step further uh, and be more specific, in relation to Cavan Monaghan, are there any specific plans? Um, there are no plans at the moment. Um, I mean, we would respond to whatever bus errand would come to us, but as far as I am aware, there are no current plans to remove any expressway services from Cavan Monaghan. Okay, thank you very much. And just one final question. Uh, I'm right in saying that the NTA is re responsible for pricing, isn't that what we, we uh, agreed earlier on? On the PSO service, on the subsidised services. See, we set the fares, uh, oh. we approved the fares uh, for subsidised services. Okay, so nothing to do with the expressway pricing as whatsoever? No. Okay, thanks very much.